Yay, it's live. Here we are. Hey, feeling good. Like I should. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Emma. Why am I introducing myself? Anyways, hello, welcome back. So today I thought I would show you guys what a day in the life looks like for me now. I haven't really done anything like this in about two years and a lot has happened, a lot has changed. And you know, just take you through my day today. As you already saw, I usually wake up at like five. I like to wake up early. I just, I love it. I think it's the greatest time of the day. So I like wake up and I eat breakfast and then I go for my sunrise walk. At the moment, it is so bloody cold. Like it was six degrees this morning or something like that you know for people in Canada they're, they're probably like being like Emma come on like we get minus like 50 here it's cold okay it was freezing but the view was worth it the sunrise in the morning listening to my podcast not my podcast um which is an announcement I have at the end of the video too um I do my stretching all of that sort of stuff and now I'm here and I'm getting ready to what time is it it's about 8 15 in the morning I'm about to head off to training I am really into CrossFit like I I'm training like pretty properly for CrossFit at the moment even though I'm not in a CrossFit like affiliate or a gym which is the goal by the end of the year to actually get into one I've absolutely love CrossFit it has changed my whole perspective on how I treat my body how I view my body and it's really just translated into my life as well because like you go do a really hard Metcon and you're like nah I can't do this like I look at it on paper I'm like no way in hell am I gonna get through it and like I'm midway through it and I'm like no no way in hell but then I actually end up completing it and I feel pretty good about myself you know I'm like whoa that was a hard thing and I got through it translating that into life you know hard things are going to come about and it just reinforces self-belief and confidence that I can achieve anything you know so I'm very thankful to have found CrossFit today is kind of like an easy day active recovery type day for CrossFit at the moment in my training so this morning I'm going to head to the gym and do a machine piece on the bike and then go to the pool to do a swim yeah today's actually quite a busy day I've got a lot of jobs to do today not a lot of work because I'm kind of still in that period where I'm getting clients and I'm trying to organize consults and set them up and everything like that which if you didn't know already I am offering one-on-one -on -one nutrition coaching online so it's absolutely open to anyone you know if you want to learn how to fuel your body properly have any body composition goals I can help you guys like achieve it in a really non-restrictive healthy way help you develop and nurture a really healthy positive relationship with food for more information about that I will leave my website link down below and I'll leave the application form down below so you can jump on board before I need to go to training I need to go eat something first so let's go make some crumpets crap I take with me feels like I'm packing for a weekend away or something like that I have my swim bag which has like a different pair of shoes and all that and I have my normal gym bag and then I have my water and yeah but anyways that's just the least of my problems let's go
so cold. Oh my god. <laughs> hey guys. So that was amazing. That was oh my god. So I did my bike session up at the gym and then I've just finished with my swim. Um I couldn't film in there because they were doing school swimming lessons and I thought mm, better not. Oh it is currently uh 11.17 and I need to go home, dripping wet, go home, have a shower. You can't see me. I can't set this up. I'm not used to YouTube anymore. I need to go home. I need to shower. I need to eat something and I need to go back out again. So let's go. So it is now... 12.27 and I need to go back out now. I need to go to the doctor's surgery to pick up something for my dad. And then I need to go to the shops to get some food. But not a lot um, because I do my big food shops on Sunday. Hopefully this is the last time I'm going out today because I kind of don't want to go out anymore. Also, I think the pool made me really dehydrated today. Like, I drink electrolyte water when I go swimming but like... I've already like chugged one of these and I'm up to like my, I don't even know, I think my third one today. Jesus. Alrighty guys, I just finished my shopping. I didn't get much. I honestly, why did I go? There was no point. I could have waited until Sunday, but yet again. I don't know where that led to, but um, I basically got some frozen blueberries, frozen strawberries, and two of these, two avocados. That's it. <laughs> I'm going to go home now for good, and I'll get stuck into some work and talk to you about my podcast. All right, see you when I get home. Let's chat about the podcast that I am launching, or by the time you watch this video, my podcast would be live. Yay, it's live here we are so i'm very happy to announce everything's just been happening recently like i've just started you know taking on clients and now i'm just launching this podcast it feels so surreal but anyways i'm very happy to announce that i am i've now launched my podcast it is called fuel to thrive um here it is right here i basically have always wanted to start a podcast ever since i was started youtube back in like 2019 or whatever it was and yeah i you know the theme for this year for me has just been going all in with creating the life of my absolute dreams and doing the podcast has been a part of that so i just was like you know what that's it it's time to go all in and make this happen and yeah that's what i've done i've just launched my podcast so basically that platform for me is going to be where i share more stories experiences talk about topics within nutrition and like health and that sort of stuff like it's a better platform for me to share like my insights and opinions and knowledge and all of that sort of stuff because it's really hard to do it on youtube like i just want to get my message across to people right and podcast is the perfect platform to do that right and i yeah i just want to impact inspire educate all of you guys and just really educate you on nutrition right because there's so much so much misinformation out there at the moment you know i don't want you guys to fall down the same trap that i did so i want to get myself out there to share what i've been through my experiences my journey and hopefully once I get this in the hang of things with the podcast, start interviewing some people and that sort of stuff. So yeah, I'm really, really, really excited that I've actually launched this podcast. So the first episode that is launched right now basically explains my entire health journey. I felt superior because I was eating the most healthiest out of everyone I knew around me. Like I felt I was so good, right? And then I was seeing these particular girls, you know, eating way healthier than me and I was just like hmm the entire thing like I got really real and honest with you guys and this is something that I owe to a lot of people especially for those who have stuck around with me all these years like a lot has happened like I've told bits and pieces like okay I'm not this anymore I'm not vegan like I went through my disor disordered eating orthorexia but I kind of haven't really had a chance for me to actually explain full detail like why and what was going through my head and everything like that so this is a real open honest you know conversation and story and so i really hope that that episode inspires you and helps you in some way yeah tell your friends tell your family check it out 
Fuel the Fire podcast and yeah so this afternoon and I've got a proper microphone for it too so I am like all set ready to go so this afternoon I need to double check my uh, follow-ups for clients and stuff like that just spending the afternoon doing some you know back-end business sort of stuff I better knuckle down and get some stuff done and I'll catch back in with you soon <laughs> That concludes my day today. For the rest of the night, I literally hardly do anything. Like, I just journaled. I did my mobility, my massage gun, my stretching. I just eat some more oats and watch some little bit of YouTube. Maybe do a little bit more work. Just chill out for the rest of the night because I, like, hit the hay at, like, 8.30. Thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you for coming along. Hope you got a good insight of what my days kind of look like now and what they're going to look like now. Um, once again, go check out my podcast. It is now live when this video goes up. As I said at the start of the video, if you are interested in working with me, I am offering at the moment one-on-one -on -one nutrition coaching. So if you want to find out more information on what I have to offer and how I can help you and that sort of stuff, um, you can check out my website down below and I'll leave the application forms and all of that down below. Or if you've got any questions, just hit me a message on Instagram, which is at Emma Clark underscore nutrition. Um, let me know what type of videos you want to see from me now. Um, and I, I really enjoyed doing this. I kind of missed it. Like... This platform just allows me to truly be myself. So yeah, I missed I missed this. I missed you guys. So um thank you so much. Like, subscribe, comment down below anything you want, and I will see you in my very next video. Peace out.